We are gathered here today because of our great love for James and Anne Marie to witness the uniting of this couple and the holy institution of marriage. The vows that they will be declaring in just a few moments are not just words or simple religious formality. They are making a lifetime commitment to each other today. This is a holy and sacred moment, one that we enter into reverently. Amory and I have been best friends since we were four. We've overcome a lot of differences. We are completely different people. But the things that we're different about that I think it's just, she always is there for people immediately whenever. And honestly, I'm not. And she loves the outdoors, hate it. <laughs> she animals, not for me. It's just completely different people. However, we've lasted for more than 20 years as truly best friends because of these major points of we constantly encourage each other. We are always learning from each other and we always challenge each other as people. For, for James specifically, um, you know, I just wanted to let you know one thing and that's, you know, I'm, I'm really proud of you. Um, and I, I look up to you a lot. You know, you're a lot more mature than I am. <laughs> Anne-Marie, you are a beautiful bride. Your true beauty, though, is found in the person you are. I will always remember and treasure what you said when we sat down to discuss today's ceremony. Your exact words to me were your prayer for today. Lord, this isn't our wedding, it's yours. Proverbs 31.30 says, Charm is deceitful and beauty is vain, but a woman who fears the Lord is to be praised. That is you, Anne-Marie. Although I won't be there for you 24-7, I know. <laughs> I know James will be. And I hope that he encourages you, that he learns from you, and that he challenges you. And now, by the authority committed to me as a minister of the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ, I declare that James and Anne Marie are now husband and wife James, you may kiss your breath. Look at those who stand with you as your bridesmaids and groomsmen, your family and friends. It's obvious that you guys are deeply loved and truly blessed.